This hurdy gurdy is a very special one. It's really medieval. It has a medieval model. It has been constructing according to medieval principles and it has been laid out especially for playing medieval music. I will tell you about this wonderful and unique instrument, demonstrate it and explain things. First, it's a hurdy gurdy. Trelaya, Fiela, Hu, Chironda in other languages. So it's a string instrument. The strings vibrate because of a wheel rotating against them. The wheel does the same as the bow on a violin, only a bow has two ends where the sound stops. Violin players always discuss where the bow must go up or down, while the wheel is going around and around. Endless. That's perfect. The usual hurdy gurdy has one or more melody strings. This one has two melody strings playing together. Two strings makes the sound fuller and nicer. It has keys for playing both melody strings together. It has one or more drone strings. This one has two drone strings, both giving a fixed tone, much like the drone pipes of a bagpipe, lending the melody character and power. Moreover, as most modern hurdy gurdies, it has a buzz string for playing rhythmic accents, also called trumpet string. It works by accelerating the wheel. However, this is an addition. There is no indication that such a facility existed before 1500. The player is free to use it or not. The hurdy-gurdy originated in the Middle Ages, in the 11th century or about that time. And most of them looked like a fiddle with a wheel. Nowadays, makers of hurdy-gurdies make instruments that are quite different in construction, character and view. A well-known type is the traditional French hurdy-gurdy, often with that typical round loot bag that originated in the 17th century. There are also the traditional Hungarian hurdy-gurdy, the traditional Russian-Ukrainian hurdy-gurdy and modern hurdy-gurdies. Some of them electroacoustic types. Starecy moho pustinu šeki spasos jod, kažnu juhu svobodu on pričašos.
a medieval model. It is not. It could be 17th century type. It's uh, not so old. Probably the earliest type of hurdy-gurdy was the organistrum of about 1100, a large two-person instrument. It could play a variable drone in so-called parallel organum, accompanying a singer. Such instruments have been reconstructed in recent times. It is rather plausible that the hurdy-gurdy that could play a melody with a fixed drone originated from the organistrum under the influence of the bagpipe. Nowadays, as far as I know, medieval hurdy-gurdies of the melody plus drone type are made by present-day makers of hurdy-gurdies only in one form, the box hurdy-gurdy, such as this one. Box Hurdy Gurdy is often called Symphony or Symphonia, although that was the name of any Hurdy Gurdy in medieval times. This type of instrument can be seen in a few medieval pictures of Hurdy Gurdies, but probably it was not a very usual type in medieval times. This one here is a very sweet instrument, really perfect for accompanying a singer. It has a sound that blends well with the singers and the medieval instruments in the group where I play, but it has a rather modest character and it is not very suitable for louder music or outdoor playing. That asks for a hurdy-gurdy of the larger medieval models, such as this one.